This is just a quick video demonstration to show you how to run your uh, PC games on your Android tablet. It doesn't matter what kind of tablet you have as long as it can run a specific app. Uh, this is a companion set. You'll need a PC that is capable of running these games, of course, and then the app for Android, which is called Kany. Uh, there's a free demo version that you can download and try just to make sure it works with your setup. Uh, some of the limitations are it only shows in black and white, and I think it doesn't have any sound. Um, but let's let's get into looking at how to set this up. So this is just a regular Nexus 7 that I have. Um, as you can see here, I already have my server set up with the the password and my IP address. So I'm gonna go ahead and connect. And it always seems to fail the first time, but it'll work the second time. I'm not sure what's up with that. And you can see here that I already have Final Fantasy XIV running. And it's picking that up. So let's go ahead and do this. Oh yeah, it was turning a quest in. Alright. Now what I'm doing is I'm controlling this with a Xbox 360 controller. As you can see the movements are pretty... There's a slight delay, but not enough to make it so that you couldn't play the game. I mean, I haven't, I haven't noticed it too much. Um, the quality depends on your own network settings. If your router if you don't have a very good router or your internet connection upload speed isn't that great, you probably won't see great results. But I've really enjoyed being able to play my PC games on my Android tablet using Kany. Because when the NVIDIA Shield was announced, I was really interested in that, but not for $300. So what I do is turn the settings, or turn the controls off on the tablet because I don't want to control it with a touch screen even though it does have profiles that you can set up and control it that way. And then I just play the game. As you can hear the sound comes through great. Battles and everything are super easy. Just everything that you would normally have on your PC, you can have here. And if you have a wireless 360 controller like I have, um, any game that supports a 360 controller, which is most modern games to be honest, um, you can play them with the controller controlling your PC, but watch on your tablet. Which is just a really, really great way to have a rigged NVIDIA Shield without having to fork out all that money. Because, let's be honest, if, you, if you're a technophile, you probably have an Android tablet. I'll include the links below in the description for setting up Kany and uh, for both the demo and the download version. The download version is $2.99 in the Google Play Store. It is highly worth it. Uh, I haven't. This does have the ability to play over the internet. Now I haven't tested over the internet. This is just on my local LAN. But if you travel a lot and you don't want to take a gaming laptop or you don't want to bring your PC with you. If you could set up your PC so that the IP remains static, or you could update it, um, you could definitely play games across the internet, of course, depending on your connection. But that's just a quick look at Kany for Android and Windows. Uh, they do have a Windows app that lets you play this um, through Google Chrome. I haven't tested that myself because I wanted to use the Android device. But yeah, this is a great substitute for the NVIDIA Shield.